going to Thunder Bay. Yeah. Thunder Bay. Thunder Bay. Thunder Bay. Let's go. Goodbye, Rossport. It was a pleasure. Where are we, Katie? We're in Lake Superior! <gasps> it's a double rainbow! Oh my god! Oh my god! The sea otters out there in the middle of the screen. What should I do? You should cast your line over there. Why? Because a huge fish just jumped. What kind of fish do you think it was? A backflipper. A backflipping <laughs> fish. I should really cast my line over there and catch backflipping fish. That was our camp for the night. What do you think, Grady? September 13th, day 60, more or less. I don't know if it's actually been 60. And I have Katie with me. <laughs> Katie and I have been friends since high school, sort of. With a gap in the middle. With a gap in the middle. <laughs> Katie is awesome and wanted to come paddling. How's it been? Terrible. Yeah. Pretty, pretty terrible. Pretty terrible. Not really nice out here. No, it's like not, not beautiful at all. No. Camp sucks. What did you expect coming into this? I don't know. I thought it would be a bit of a cakewalk. Did you? Yeah. Anything else? Well, I thought you might have like. Something organized for food. Uh, yeah. yeah, I left the, all the food up to Katie, and she's sort of failed. We've we've just been eating berries, and Scrunching. I don't know what I don't even know whatever this plant is, but we've been eating it. <laughs> strawberry leaves. Strawberry leaves. Are those strawberry leaves? I don't know if those are those tiny strawberry leaves. Yeah. Yeah, lichen doesn't taste that good. I was chewing on Turning into maybe a maybe it was a caribou spine or or an otter spine. I don't know. I was chewing on some spine the other day because I just <laughs> needed some calcium. Yeah, it's been tough. Do you think we'll survive? I don't know if we'll survive. So yeah, we we left Rossport a few days ago. We left Rossport on September the 9th. And another paddle, and then another paddle. <laughs> we have had quite a bit of headwinds. Not too much favorable wind, but we've been able to duck out between some islands, which has been pretty nice. Had some decent sized waves. <laughs> Just amazing conditions, right? Incredible conditions. Glassy, one might say. Glassy, yeah. yeah. Glassy, really favorable wind. <laughs> Just beautiful day out here on the lake. Imagine if I wasn't able to be paddling, we might get a little further. Oh yeah, that's true, right? I guess I'm supposed to be paddling, aren't I? Currently we're going in circles. You're doing you're doing a great job. It's really it's really important that I film you struggling away by yourself here. And today the waves are too big and the wind's too strong for us to really make any progress. We're just hanging out on this island. Which is pretty awesome. It's been pretty awesome the whole time. Oh, we had a the sauna, CPR slip. CPR slip in Squaw Harbor. Some amazing guy in uh, Thunder Bay donated his land to, I guess, a bunch of fisher folk and sailors and yacht people who 
had built a shelter and a sauna, and we had it to ourselves one night, which is, we ate really well. We played the ball toss. I won. Katie won. Met some amazing people, stopped in at Robert's, had some coffee with some Carolines. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. That was right after we found the snowmobile helmet with a spine attached. I'm sorry, it wasn't attached. I was on a different beach. <laughs> in my memory, in my memory, it will now be the snowmobile helmet and the spine. The decapitated snowmobiler. Where are we now? I don't know. I thought you were doing the navigation. This is oh, West Fish. I thought that was west. I thought we were heading that way. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, we just paddled by this giant eagle who was hanging in the tree. It looked very regal. towards the Sleeping Giant in Thunder Bay. And it's a beautiful morning. And I dreamt that Katie slept with a bear last night. <laughs> she said it was a bit rough, but okay. <laughs> First the bear was gnawing on my head while I was in the tent. That didn't feel that great, but then all of a sudden Katie was gone. I was like, oh no, where's Katie? And she came back out of the bear den. A little scruffed up, but so she was okay. She's like, yeah, I had to take that one for the team. <laughs> <laughs> and then I think I beat the bear over the head with a club. <laughs> Those are really insightful words for your last day paddling. <laughs> this guy really likes us. He wants to come for a swim. Yeah. Breakfast. <laughs> he sells a good food. Oh, look at that. He's thinking about it. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> this is amazing. You look so 
so furry and friendly. He's pretty little. Yeah, he's a little guy. Coming into Thunder Bay here. Beautiful, calm evening. About 125 kilometers. Probably more like 140 kilometers. And we're here to meet uh, Katie's parents. Who appear to be lost. Six days on the water? Yeah, yeah Marcus is what? 60 days? 63 days. days. Yeah. I hope that worked, Marcus. Let's find out first. Oh, yeah, I'm sure it's fine. You might have to do it again. Oh, I, I think we're good. I don't know. 